Good morning, everyone. My name is Ebony, and welcome to another video. Think I know you better, better to forget her. Certain people may for her. another day in my life vlog uh, mostly because I don't have a video for Sunday uh, today is Saturday and I don't have a video for tomorrow and I genuinely just thought about like not uploading a video but like I didn't want to not upload so I was like hmm what if I do a vlog the issue is I really need to film my March wrap-up but unfortunately I don't have time to film today because in about an hour I have to leave for work actually a little less than an hour and I'll be working from 10 until 3 and then at 3 I have to be back on campus because my boyfriend is giving some of my friends a tour of the campus, like friends who are going to be going to this college next year. And so I have to be there for that. Right after that we're going home so I don't have time to sit in front of my bookshelf and film. I was going to film it last night but I was just so exhausted after getting off work that I just didn't have the motivation to film. Plus my camera was dead so I couldn't even... I would have had to wait like an hour and a half for my battery to charge and then film and I would have been filming at like 10 o'clock at night. So that wasn't, that wasn't the mood. <laughs> Stay tuned, I am hoping to film my March wrap up like when I come back from home over the weekend. And so that'll hopefully be up on Thursday, hopefully. <laughs> so aside from that, right now it is 9.05 and I have to go to work at 10. So I have to leave in like 30 minutes actually. I lied earlier. <laughs> this morning I woke up at eight, looked at my phone for a little bit and then took a shower, put some clothes on, got a little bit ready. I still have to do my makeup before I go to work and I still haven't eaten breakfast. I've been listening to my audiobook for A Torch Against the Night. Um, I don't know how well you can see my phone, but I'm doing like a buddy read of that with Mare from Mare Reads and Nicole from Nicole Reads and some other people too. Right now I need to clean up and I'm actually a Will's dorm right now. I don't, I didn't say that before because I stayed at his dorm last night and then he had, um, some stuff he had to do like really early in the morning so he's not even here so yeah i need to clean up probably pack up all my stuff because i'm probably not going to come back here before i leave to go home so i should pack up all my things and also i need to figure out what i'm going to do for breakfast because will has literally no food i'll probably just go get some food from somewhere but first we must clean camera to sit on anything that's high enough for you to see me that well. I'm just filling my water bottle. I hate doing my makeup at Will's dorm because there's like a giant, sorry the water filter is going, there's like a giant uh, counter in the way like where the sink is so I can't get to the mirror and I'm blind. I'm so blind. So like my face needs to be like this close to the mirror for me to see what I'm doing and so like I have to like lean over the mirror like this and like try to do my makeup. It's like really like a pain in the butt. I just, I hate doing my makeup here. At my dorm, we have a mirror hanging on the back of the door so I can just stand right up next to it, which is really nice, but here I can't do that. Now I think I've got pretty much everything. I have about 20 minutes until I need to leave for work, but I'm just gonna probably leave now since I'm gonna stop somewhere and get something to eat. Okay. I'm in my car, please ignore this, it's my tassel from graduation. I have to figure out where I want to go to eat because I don't really like go to places for breakfast usually. I know like some places like McDonald's and stuff have like breakfast menus but like I'm not a big breakfast person. I don't really like breakfast foods that much so like I don't know where to go. I think I'm just gonna go to the gas station and like find something. Oh my gosh you guys, I have been struggling. So basically I went inside to get some food. I got this like yogurt granola thing and then like a croissant, a breakfast croissant. And then I got out here and I started pumping my gas because I realized I needed gas. And then I realized I didn't grab a spoon for my yogurt. And so then I go back inside, grab the spoon, come out here, finish pumping gas, come sit down. The spoon was in my back pocket. I broke the spoon. Like, the bottom half broke off. I could still use it, but it's like way shorter. 
And I'm just like, oh, what else can go wrong? I was gonna eat while I was pumping gas and then I realized I didn't have spoons and I had to go back inside. And now I have to go to work, like I don't have time for this. I'm gonna have to eat while I'm driving. Okay, I made it to work. Um, I'm like parked outside of it right now and I ate all my food. Thankfully, I was able to eat it all and I still have a little bit of time before I have to go inside. Um, but I wanted to give you a quick update um, before I go into work. I, Like I said, I've been listening to the audiobook for Torch Against the Night. I started at, I think, 19% this morning and I'm at 30%. So, like, I'm making some pretty good progress. I still have about five hours of actual listening time, about 10 hours of audiobook time since I listen on double speed. So, yeah, mostly the reason I really need to get through this book soon because it's due in two days back to Libby. And I have two other books that are also due on that same day. I don't think I'll be able to get to both of them, but one of them is The Project by Courtney Summers, and I'm like super excited to read that book, so I really want to try to finish A Torch Against the Night and also read The Project. The other one I have is Get a Life Chloe Brown, which I am excited for and I do want to read, but like I'm more excited for The Project, so I'm going to prioritize that. Of course, if I can get to all three, like yay, that's a exactly what I'm gonna do but I don't think it's gonna happen I'm about to go into work gotta silence my phone <laughs> I suppose I should probably go inside and um I'll update you guys when I get done like I said I get off at three hopefully three I might end up staying later depending on what they need but um yeah I'll update you when I get done okay hi everyone so it's uh 4 15 um we just got done giving those like tours. Like I said, my boyfriend is uh, an ambassador. He gives tours on campus. Uh, and so I had some friends who I was like, I can get you personal tours if you'd like, because right now they're really not doing that many tours because pandemic. But um, like I had some friends and I was like, yeah, I can have my boyfriend give you a personal tour. Unfortunately, the day that it worked out for them to do that is the same. Today is like new student admitted day or whatever. And so Will had to work that. It's the first event that they've even had since we shut down for the pandemic uh, last March. So like Will had to work that. And so he had to work all day until three. And then they had their tour like immediately at three. And so like, I feel really bad for Will because he's been on his feet all day giving tours. And so like, I'm, I feel bad. So we're gonna, I think we're gonna do something fun for him. We might, I haven't even eaten lunch yet. It's almost dinner time. So I'm pretty sure Will probably hasn't eaten either. So we'll probably go get food. I have to talk to Will and see what he wants to eat. But I don't know, maybe we'll go somewhere fun. Uh, so right now I'm in my car, uh, I'm gonna go over to pick up Will and then we are going to get food and then go to my house. So yay! Hi vlog, I'm exhausted. <laughs> I gave seven tours of our campus this morning. That's a lot. It's a lot. Yeah. Uh, we got Taco Bell. Well I got Taco Bell. Will said he wasn't hungry. We did get him Cinnamon Delight whatever. Cinnamon Delights yeah. from Taco Bell. They are delicious. Because he was a good boy. <laughs> I could buy them myself. <laughs> I got them for you because I love you. I know, I love you too, babe. Thank you. <laughs> They're delicious. Um, but I got like actual food too because I haven't eaten since 9 a.m. Actual food is debatable since it's Taco Bell. Okay, shut up. <laughs> It, shut up! I, that's a that's a gripe on Taco Bell, not you. I know, I wanted Chipotle, but I didn't want to have to go inside. Like, I wanted to just go through the drive through Okay, but we're going to read. Because that's what this channel is about. <laughs> we are we, now a food review channel. No, we're not. <laughs> yes, we are. <laughs> what are we reading, Will? You want to hold up the book? We're reading Little Caesars. No, what? I'm just kidding. We're reading Flowers. We're reading Spirit Bound. By Rochelle Lee. It's the fifth book in the Vampire Academy series. Why are you Scottish? I don't know because it was fun to say spirit bound like that. <laughs> um, we're only on like page 20. We started it yesterday. We have a lot to read before the end of the month. Procrastination. Not even the end of the month. It's next week. But if you didn't know, I co-host the Vampire Academy and Bloodlines Read Along. Uh, I don't know. Wow, that's fine. Wow. That's good lighting. Saturation much. I don't know how you wouldn't know because I say it in like every video. But next week on Saturday, we will be doing the live show for Spirit Bound. So if you like Vampire Academy or you want to read it for the first time and you want to read all five books before Saturday, you can join us. <laughs> Where are we, Will? Oh yeah, we were vlogging. We're back at your house. Hi, B J. Hello. Like cookies and cream. Hi, baby. <laughs>
She got shaved. I'll, I'll put in a picture of what she looked like before she got shaved. <laughs> Hello. The bow, the bow tie? Where is it? Right there. Oh, she got a little bow tie. Oh, my baby. <laughs> and then that's a book. He also got a little bit of a trim. You can't really tell too much, but... He's a bit more of a fluff ball than he was. His fur used to be, like, really yeah. matted around. Also, his... ignore that corner. <laughs> <laughs> this is my room, but technically my mom's throw-everything-in-here room. <laughs> yeah, it's it's your mom's catch-all drawer as a room, <laughs> yeah. which is... Very inconvenient. Well, it's funny because every room. other room is that too. <laughs> <laughs> but I was telling Will earlier, we were looking at my shelf, which is back there, uh, that I only have eight unread books on that shelf, except for the Bloodline series, which of course I will be reading as part of the VA and Bloodlines read along. So, like, I'm not counting those just because, like, I know exactly I'm reading this in this month. Like, I don't have to. It's not like I'm putting it off, you know? The books that I haven't read are. The Lord of the Rings and The Red Pyramid and The Serpent Shadow by Rick Riordan. Haven't gotten to those yet. And in this stack, I haven't read Traffic by Ellen Hopkins, Codename Verity, or Miss Peregrine's Love of Peculiar Children. But other than that, I have read all of these books if you don't include the textbooks that are in that stack. Because I've only read part of them because textbooks are lame and we don't read textbooks if we don't need to. Right, Will? <laughs> yep. Only read what is absolutely necessary, which is usually necessary. I zoomed in so far on your face. <laughs> <laughs> hey everyone, so it's actually the next day. It's actually like the next evening because I didn't close the vlog. I didn't, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm literally about to sit down and edit this vlog and put it up hopefully tonight. Uh, so <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing with my life. <laughs> um, but yeah, basically last night we ended up going to the park to play frisbee golf with my dad and we took my dog. I should have vlogged that. I don't know what I was thinking. I didn't take my camera with me because I was afraid I would lose it. <laughs> um, and then we went home, we ate some dinner, we watched some TV, and then we went to bed. We really didn't do a whole lot of that much interesting stuff. Um, so I'm sorry that I feel like this video doesn't have that much content, so I'm sorry about that. But also like... I didn't know what to put up today and I really wanted to upload a video today because I don't want to skip uploads and I didn't have time to film an actual video so I hope this suffices. I hope it gives you a little bit of insight of like what I do in a day. Thanks for watching. Sorry if it wasn't super fun or entertaining but I hope you liked it and make sure you're subscribed, follow the social media, all that jazz and I'll see you in my next video. It's going to be my March wrap up, I promise. <laughs> Bye. Oh